When I was five years old, my mom, my mom and I got an apartment on East 39th Street in Flatbush, Brooklyn. Our landlady was a widow named Clara Seeger. That summer, Mrs. Seeger taught me checkers and we played all the time. She was either a, a brilliant teacher or I was a prodigy because I never once lost. <laughs> that apartment was the seventh household I'd lived in by that time, including nearly a year and several placements in foster care. Because of older adults like Mrs. Seeger, it turned out all right for me. They taught me a lot, a lot more than checkers. They taught me how to make sense of a crazy and often very difficult world. In 2002, I joined Family Promise, the leading national organization addressing family homelessness. In case you are not aware of the extent of the problem, I will give you a simple statistic. Last year, one out of 30 children experienced homelessness. If you all were in elementary school, four of you wouldn't know where you're sleeping tonight. A few years ago, we created a financial literacy program for the parents that we serve, helping, them get, helping families not just get housing, but sustain it. They learn to separate needs from wants, make and keep a budget, and avoid the predatory environment that people in poverty face. Talking to Maria in Modesto, she summed it up this way. This program changed my life. I wish I'd had this when I was a kid. And then, pointedly, why can't my kids have this? So there is a need, but there is also an opportunity. That's why I'm here today. If we want to break the cycle of poverty, if we want to help children have a future that is markedly different then they're present. We've got to give them skills and connections. To accomplish this, we will harness the Encore generation, people in the community who have the experience, passion, and commitment. Family Promise has a scale. With more than 200 affiliates across the country built on volunteers, we can create templates, pilot, trial, and then perfect a financial literacy program for children at risk. Working with older adults, children can understand the value of saving of planning, of making choices with the future they want in mind. They can know adults are invested in their lives and their success. With this prize, we can impact the lives of 15,000 children over the next five years. And what gets me most excited about this is, by developing these templates, any organization that serves children marked by housing insecurity, not just our affiliates, can tap into its Encore generation and empower this next generation. Every community has far too many children at risk, but every community also has hundreds of Mrs. Seegers. The time I spent with Clara Seeger taught me a lot, but the most important lesson I learned was about expecting a future which every child deserves. Thank you.